The story begins today with Saitama, a creative Japanese IT engineer in the UK who moves to Port Talbot due to redundancies caused by Brexit. In Port Talbot, he met a guide dog called Peace through a stalking process influenced by Sophie Calais to understand the skein of territory, matter and program. With support from crowdfunding backers, this ignites the production of Peace version 1.0 in which it is an interface with the body transformed by technological manipulations of the guide dog to aid disabled users. Meanwhile, through the game board mapping techniques of Chora, he meets a handful of entrepreneurs, artisans and biohackers who are interested in version 1.0 and forms a tech startup called Peace after the guide dog. They aim to conquer the conspiracy stalkers representing the pro-robotic transhuman skepticisms of the post-human future. From 2020, through the derivative mapping techniques of situationists, Peace locates a bizarre used space of land under the M4 motorway at Junction 40, at the centre of Taibak residential area, a potential site for version 2.0. In 2025, version 2.0 becomes a landmark urban intervention funded by local angel investors. Features of version 1.0 are extrapolated at a macro urban scale, open source to all the public influence from the text of sustainable versioning systems by Usman Hack. By 2030, Kurzweil's speculations of emerging strong AI are realised, replacing many labour-demanding jobs, has been taken over by cheap Chinese corporations, while humans are contaminated with Western antibiotics, vaccinations and GMO foods. Quality of life decreases with high rates of depression and chronic diseases. Through venture capital, farm funding and appointment of local architect Leslie Lam, Peace version 3.0 is a response to this physical and psychological erosion. While Peace members grow old themselves, they design a biohacking hub acting as an interface with the local community with transcending methods of transformative technology, responsive programs and the preservation of sentimental objects in order to bring back their personal memories and relationships of their dis disappearing past as well as restoring natural human health and well-being. The population of the community steel dependent Port Talbot are in an unemployment crisis with the collapse of the local steel industry. With their low academic level, they are made redundant with the replacements of strong AI. Therefore, they volunteer to be Peace's guinea pig barrel hackers to test out their device prototypes designed by Saitama in return for their own living space, subsidised rent and possible health benefits. In order to sustain this core programme, a variety of interconnected programmes and events take place. This then marks the beginning of version 4.0, marking version 3.0 as a historical and sentimental memory. Another layer is added as a stepping stone to transcend back to human nature through future transformative technology in the midst of the post-human epoch.